colleague Alice Hibbert spoke to two experts currently in Vienna, Alan Burstein from the Global HIV Vaccine Enterprise and Juliana Saka, a doctor who questions the official HIV AIDS theory. And nobody could give me the paper where HIV is isolated uh, in the way uh, scientists uh, were asking for it since the, 70, uh, since the 70s. The other thing is that there ex doesn't exist any paper uh, that uh, shows if HIV is existing, how it is doing AIDS. And the special uh, situation is that AIDS is a fully different thing in the, in the Western countries, so-called Western Western countries and the so-called developing countries in, in Africa and, and South, uh, South America and so on. So it, is, it doesn't fit in a normal virus uh, disease because viruses uh, only can make a very few things. They are not uh, so intelligent to do so many things. It doesn't fit in a viral cause. Okay, let's uh, turn to Mr. Burstein there. What's your reaction to that? Yeah. Well, a, a couple of points. Um, the first point that, that, that's been raised is the virus has never been isolated. Well, that simply is not true. Um, the virus has been isolated. It's been molecularly cloned using uh, DNA cloning technologies. It's been sequenced literally thousands of times from different individuals infected with the virus. And so uh, it simply isn't true to say it's never been isolated. Secondly, um, uh, no one knows how the virus causes immunodeficiency is also not true. Um, we know very well how HIV works now. Uh, I would say that it is true that uh, HIV is cloned uh, thousands of times, but cloning means to take something from a clone. If it is a clone, you have to have the original, and the original is never, never shown in any paper.